Oh, great. Franny gets the chant. Uh, many of you know my wife, Franny. Franny and I have been married for 37 years, many of them happy. Now, honey, how are you? How are you voting on November 6th on, on, on this amendment? No! And if you had to marry me all over again, <laughs> would you? Maybe. <laughs> I kind of left it up to her on what the joke would be. It's okay. You know, Franny and I have have um, two kids. We have a 31-year-old daughter and 27-year-old son, and George F. Will, the conservative the columnist, said, and this is a number of years ago, and I know that his daughter is exactly the same age as, as our daughter, Thomason. He said that uh, when his daughter and, and her friends find out that someone they know or a friend is, is gay, it's about as interesting as learning that they're left-handed. <laughs> to me, it's, it's a little more interesting, but I'm 61. <laughs> but I really feel that this is an issue that we have gained so much from the people who are so courageous who came out when it wasn't so easy to do. And people, and people realized that their uncle was gay. And suddenly they were saying, hey, it's okay to be gay. Or their aunt, or their sister, or their brother, or their cousin. And we know what this is really, this is about love. This is about love. And this is about the right to love someone like I love Franny, and I think Franny loves me. I want to thank Amy Klobuchar for reminding everyone how close my election was. That was very nice of her. <laughs> I won by 312 votes. Now, but think about that. I don't want any of you to wake up on November 7th and say to yourself, you know, I wish I'd worked just a little bit harder on this. Now, there are sign up, there are clipboards going around where you can sign up for shifts. Okay? And I want you to do it. Are you going to sign up? Yeah. Are you going to sign up? Yeah. Okay, now you can sign up for, you know, a three hour shift or a four hour shift. I guess they're four hour shifts. And you can sign up for as many as you want. Now, there's a lot, a lot of students here, a lot of people of different ages. Some of you, for example, have families. Ignore them. Over the next, <laughs> over the next eight days, let, let me tell you something about kids. And I see a lot of kids here, so I see a lot of parents of kids. I say, an eight-year-old knows how to operate a microwave. Let me tell you that. How old are you? You're nine. Can you operate a microwave? Yes, you see. And do you like it when your parents leave you at, at home alone so you can watch, do whatever you want? <laughs> yes, he does. He does. <laughs> Let me tell you another thing. 
an eight-year-old can teach a four-year-old to operate the microwave. You know how to use microwave, right? And we've established this, okay. The point is, get it, sign up. Sign up. Because Amy is right. When you make personal contact, that's what makes a difference. We know that. We know that. We want everyone who wants to be married to be able to be married. That's all we want. And you're going to do it. Thank you for being here tonight. What a beautiful crowd. Sign these things. If you're cheering, you got to sign up. Thank you.